Hi, what's up my toxic gamers? Today we are talking about the next Battlefield game. It has been teased. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. We are talking about the next Battlefield game, my brothers. Like and subscribe if you're brand new. And you can always change it into a dislike if you get to the end and you do not enjoy. Bruh. But let's actually talk about this one, right? I posted I posted this over my Twitter. If you got Twitter, I would love to have you around. The next Battlefield game ha engine has been teased to be the new version of Frostbite. EA says that it's going to have next level destruction. This is the Frostbite logo, which I covered in the last video. But this is brand new. This just happened where... Uh, and this is why I'm making this video. Because they say that next level destruction, massive and progressive damage on terrain architecture and vehicles which even enables altering the flow of a map or a level that's oh, shit. Oh. and i want on i want everybody on this situation immediately okay we gotta have an emergency meeting do you think that this is real do you actually want to believe in this story okay because i know for the fact that this <laughs> This is what it was, but admittedly though right now a lot of people are saying Battlefield 2042 is actually fun It's actually good and even in the very beginning when we had and there's a video that I want to show you as well guys stick around for that uh, But even when we had Battlefield 2042, I always loved its gunplay I that's like one thing that I really really liked. I love the clean look as well But I hated the fact that it was super clean. It, it was clean, but it was super clean to the point where it just didn't feel felt like a battlefield game it's hard to explain but uh, I, I guess the best way i can uh, explain is that battlefield 3 right that game looks clean as hell but it also looks real uh realistic it's fun it's also looks like a battlefield game got destruction although it's not a lot but i mean it's definitely a whole lot more than battlefield 2042 but are we really gonna get it let's check this out a new Battlefield game has officially been teased by DICE and EA Games. Now, just a couple hours ago, they teased this brand new Frostbite engine, which is the new upgraded version of the Frostbite engine, Damn. which is current. Dog, like, I still remember Battlefield 1. This game was Im insane, and it's it's still amazing. I, have, I feel like playing it after being used Don't in order to develop again. Battlefield 6. Now DICE has given us some official informations as well as they revealed the brand new logo for their upcoming Frostbite engine and as yeah, you guys boy. can see the difference between Frostbite 2 engine and Frostbite 3 engine and now the upgraded version of all the Frostbite engines which is currently being used for the upcoming Battlefield game. Now there's not a lot of... Okay that's cool and all but can a brother perhaps get to see the, the, the footage because this was for Battlefield 24 42. They even showed us destruction. Then look at the gameplay you're watching. That's our gameplay trailer, right? And uh, this game was uh, leaked to hell. Obviously, it wasn't uh, uh, you know the leak wasn't as big as Wolverine or GTA 6. Uh, how we had the Lucia Bruna leaking out and Bruh. crap like that. It wasn't as big as that. But this game was still leaked like crazy. And I know when we had the, the gameplay leak of especially this footage, there were some bad news. But then quickly after they dropped this trailer, it looked good. And and then a lot of people were like, it is looking good, man. it is going to be amazing. And then the game came out and we were all like, uh, all like this. <laughs> we were all like this. And now we are getting hype, uh, hyped up for the next Battlefield game. Listen, I, I love this franchise, dog. I love Call of Duty, GTA, uh, Battlefield. Uh, yeah, for the last few years, Call of Duty hasn't been the same. But there's good news going around about the next Call of Duty game is that, you know, we're going to be having two new Call of Duty games. So, Call of Duty 2024, this is going to be a new track game. 2025 sequel to black ops 2 so it's gonna be a black ops 2 remake not a remaster but a remake essentially it's gonna have remaster maps and also new maps similar to how modern warfare 3 is. yeah i know recycled content but that's the name of call of duty right now and for the past few years call of duty has disappointed all of us right like you guys uh, myself included everybody it disappointed us all right uh, there's still some seconds that are like yeah, yeah I, I, it's actually good it's actually good right because those definitely those people are definitely casual fans and they must have like re really started playing right now but battlefield is it gonna make a comeback one if you believe it two if you just don't but uh, don't believe it but remember no pre-orders difference in terms of logo though but then there are some very slight changes in terms of how the image doesn't look pixelated anymore okay. and we also got this brand new information which states oh, that the new engine is going to be a next level destruction and this engine is going to be enabling us to have some massive and progressive aggressive damages on the terrain architecture and vehicles which can even oh, enable yeah? altering the flow of a map or a level 
How many times we heard that? How many times we heard that, right? That we're gonna have next level destruction, next level destruction, next level destruction, and it turns out to be last gen destruction. <laughs> last gen destruction, bro. Okay, done. Give me last gen destruction. I want, I want this game to be good though. I hope this game is good. And when do you realistically see this game coming out, guys? 2024 or 2025? I mean, I can see it 2024, but definitely by the end of it. Let me know when you think about it. And, and when are we gonna get the trailer? EA Play is happening, uh, no, not EA Play, but EA Investor Call is actually happening on January the 30th. I will live stream that day, so hit the bell if you haven't already, subscribe if you're new, because during that stream, they're gonna announce more information, 110%. And trailer, I have to assume that it's most probably gonna come out either before summer, summer's Game Fest, or after, usually, if I have to take a guess, right, like, Battlefield 2042, I remember, like, its trailer was before the Summer's Game Fest, and then this gameplay trailer for multiplayer that you're currently watching uh, actually was revealed around or at the Summer Game Fest, if I'm not mistaken. It was revealed in June, that I remember. They they done the entire marketing soon, June, boom. Bruh. You know, that was kind of cringe, they, they've done that. But pr prior to June, they did... I believe revealed the launch trailer or maybe I'm mixing it up right now. I think I'm mixing it up. I think the launch trailer was in June. Bruh. I'm mixing it up right now. So, but, but yeah. So when do you think that we're going to get their trailer for this game? Now guys, it seems like after very long, the DICE yeah. decided to go ahead and change their new engines in order to make a new Battlefield game. Because so far we've only been getting similar kind of engines for Battlefield 1, Battlefield 5. But now it's finally time we'll get to see some changes here in terms of next Battlefield field game and it seems like the destruction level in this game is going to be far more different and far better yeah! come on man we hear that all the time circus always say that it's going to be different this time nope it's gonna be different this time. I, I truly hope it's different. Than what we've already seen in Battlefield 2042. Now, the last time DICE pretty much just said the same thing. They said that the game was gonna have like massive destruction and whatnot. <laughs> and now they're doing the same once again. So I'm not gonna have very high yeah. hopes in terms of how the destruction is. Big man, toxic gamer. They're gonna call him a toxic gamer because if you actually question, if you say, I'm not gonna pre order, I have worked hard for my money. So I'm not gonna pre order. They're gonna label you as toxic and problematic they always do that they've been doing that for years dog and look at this tornado it was looking so good in the cgi uh i mean it was a gameplay trailer i think it was a gameplay trailer but they maxed the graphics they shot this thing on rtx 70 billion that is something that 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 only uh aliens have access to right this was an absolute banger trailer though banger trailer i hope this upcoming game is actually a banger as well okay <laughs> but click on this video on the screen we had a ton of battlefield gameplay uh leaks and details for the battlefield 6 for the upcoming game on the left though we have xbox and playstation fanboys having a meltdown check out both of these videos and i will see you right there